Dr. Disrespect has started, he has started to do in interviews and he is possibly moving towards a comeback by the looks of it. I read through this uh, interview here on PC Gamer. It's a bit painful, honestly, to read because it just feels like he can't really talk. There was a couple of moments of, well, my lawyer and, uh, you know, I've been advised to not really go into that because, you know, for legal per and, and anytime you hear that, it's you're not getting the juice you're looking for, mm -hmm. you know. But I understand it. I can appreciate it. It is a very bizarre, very bizarre situation. Remains to be bizarre. We talked a couple of days ago about how the uh, URL, the link on his Twitter account changed to YouTube, giving up on Twitch completely in this interview he doubles down he says no matter what he does in the future it will not be on twitch he even says he's considering legal action against twitch and he goes he doubled down he's doubles down on saying that he still has no idea or he has no specific no specifics around why he was banned mm. and he and he just stays on that and anytime the interviewer here who uh respect to steven messner who he kept trying man he kept saying, wait, people are speculating this and that. And, of course, he wasn't getting anywhere. And that's hard to do as an interview. You keep hammering away at it. But the main takeaway here is that he wants to come back. I catch the feeling in this interview he really wants to come back. And he doesn't appear to be interested, based on the responses in this interview, he does not appear to be interested in any kind of exclusive deal with a particular platform. Mm. Sounds like he wants to be a free agent for a bit and just post wherever the opportunity is at that moment. And so that could be YouTube, that could be elsewhere. In fact, he also references the fact that he's really interested in things other than streaming to take the character to other places. You can speculate what that means. I don't know. Is that is that wrestling? Is that uh, movies? Is that media elsewhere? TV, Netflix? I don't really know. Of course, the market uh, for his services in those other areas likely will depend on how severe these uh, the accusations against him are or the whatever ends up coming out in, in relationship to the ban. Mm -hmm. It would be hard to bet big money on him right now without knowing the reason for his ban in the first place. Right. So there's still more questions than answers, but I can tell you, based on my, my own personal speculation, having read this and looked at the Twitter account, He's going to come back. He's going to come back sooner than I would have expected. He's a, He wants to be there for the Champions Club. And click click play on the video. So we have a video that just went out about an hour ago on his Twitter account. One minute and eight seconds. This is, of course, after this interview took place. 1.4 million views already. It's very a cyberpunk, futuristic. There's a, There are some lyrics about not knowing what to do, about not knowing where to go, or how to proceed. It's out of my hand. That's the that's the lyric, it's out of my hand. So, but I'm still in uh, control. I'm still you, in control. What do you think he's coming back? YouTube gaming? Facebook gaming? If, he, if it's not gonna be about an exclusive, then why not test the waters everywhere? Go run a stream on YouTube, run a stream on Facebook, see what works. I think he'll be on... I think he's going to test out YouTube for sure. Even in the absence of an exclusive deal, the, uh, the the structure is in place. Ninja has proven it, as well as other YouTube gamers, people on YouTube gaming. I think we're going to see him there sooner than later. That video would, would indicate. But he sounds really excited in this interview, even though he's not willing to talk about... What happened? I should say, by the way, that famous streaming reporter, reporter that talks about game streaming news, mm. continues, continues to uh, indicate or insinuate that something severely bad took place here. Even with all this comeback to our stuff going on, he continues to suggest that the whole thing is dark and grim. So I'm just going to leave that there. I'm just going to put that there. It's still a lot of unknown.